And these are from this pack. Yeah, I would actually switch it up. If you can't, let them settle. Oh, I'd probably these stink. <laughs> I would gulp those and not even know I swallowed it. So do, the, do these stink? I don't believe they sting, no. I, I saw them over in that area, over there, and uh, I've been swimming in Walden Pond for over 15 years and have never seen anything like it, so it was a completely uh, new thing to see thousands, and not just a couple jellyfish, but thousands and thousands of jellyfish. That's right, Walden Pond is fresh water and there are jellyfish here. There's actually a, a freshwater jellyfish species um, that actually has been found in, in about 44 of the 50 states <laughs> and in many temperate climates around the world. But this is a very mysterious species. Why do they go up like that? They are very small. They're a white translucent uh, jelly species that's about anywhere from the size of a dime to a quarter. This is a species that probably came from China. Uh, on board some water lilies that probably were uh, brought to, to North America by people who were introducing them into their botanical gardens in the Victorian era. It has a very unusual reproduction pattern. It'll, when we have a, a bloom of jellyfish where we'll have the medusa stage and that umbrella stage, um, it's very intermittent. It might happen once every 10 years. It might happen every few years. It might never happen here again. Oh, I swim uh, every day practically. You've never seen those little jellyfish no, before? No, no. Yeah, it's really interesting. I'm going to just never occurred to me that there would be jellyfish in here. Now I learned something new. It never occurred to yeah, me that... You might want to keep no, your eye out for sharks too. <laughs>